So uh, I'm back in the hotel room. We did the rules meeting. We went to the venue, did the rules meeting, and uh, the fights. We got we got to go back in about an hour, back hour, half hour or so. Um, checked out the ring, checked out the venue. Looks awesome. Now I'm just hanging out before the fight, and this is an interesting time. The the waiting before the fight, especially because it's, it's an early fight, it's an afternoon fight instead of a night fight. But I know what to do as a fighter with this time. As a coach, I I still haven't figured out uh, how to use this time to the best uh, potential. You know, like I don't know, like in my mind, I'm running through what each of the guys, what I want them to do, what I'm concerned about, what I uh, want to see from them, and how I can, as a coach, vocalize that to them when it's important. Be able to like get that across to them in the round and making sure, because it's this is weird because it's like a comedy fight. You know, it's not like a real fight to the outside perspective. Like I understand if people watching this are like, it's a goofy fight. Yeah, it is, but it's still my students getting punched in the face. It's still people I care about potentially getting knocked out, and I don't want that for them. So it's weird. Um, so I'm watching a bunch of, you know, best corner moments on YouTube and watching people like Nazir and, and, and Teddy, Teddy Atlas and, you know, Ray Arcel, just legends and seeing how they deal with their fighters in, in the corner. And it's a lot of times very emotional, which I'm not, I'm not an emotional coach. Um, but yeah, we're going we're gonna to try our best. Paco's fighting, then Harrington, and then main event Lewis. I'm cornering another guy. I can't remember his name right now, um, which again, I don't know him. I don't know what he's good at. So I have to just be there for water and motivation. Um, but yeah, I'm going, I'm looking for, I'm going 4-0, four 4-0 out, four out tonight. I'm expecting undefeated night. Fingers crossed. Hope no one gets hurt. Hope everyone listens well. And uh, yeah, has a good time. The venue's cool. I just hope I do a good job. I hope I don't. Uh, I have a tendency of over communicating and just say, again, the more I coach, the more I teach, it's about doing less, just less. What's the most important thing? Teetering on as the fight gets deeper, which again, these are very short fights. So it's not like a long fight where like you get so tired, you need emotional motivation to bring you back up. It's mostly technical, but we'll see. We'll have fun. I hope I do a good job. I hope the boys do well. I hope everyone's safe. I'll see you on the other side.
Touch the body, overhand right. Touch the body, overhand right. You hear my voice, you hear my voice, you hear my voice. We got a cop but I'll do it. I'll do it. You ready? Make him flinch. Yeah, you ready? Make him flinch! That's fine! Make him flinch, make him pay! Take that center! Circle off, circle off! We don't play it! Fill the air! Set up, set up! Good! Set up, he's just pushing, he doesn't know! Gloves high, gloves high. Circle. Good, set to the body, set to the body. Big breath, big breath. Hands back, Harrington. Hands back. Level change. Softer, settle, settle. Settle, settle. Get some breath, Sid. Move, good shot. Move your head, move your head. Good, now step off. Step off that line. Look where his left hand is going. Hands high, hands high. He's already tired. Hands high. Smaller punches. Nice. Small punches, Harry. Into space. Hands back up. Hands up. Hands up. Into space. Into space. Eat the space. Jab him. Jab him. No five hands, it's boxing. Ten seconds. Hand tight, hand tight, hand <laughs> so uh night's over the fights are done we did it almost went three and one for the night <clears throat> paco came out first for his fight against danny dubs did very well um landed Paco hits fucking hard. Did really well. Denny Dubs, great guy. Very nice guy. Got caught twice. You know, capping to anybody. Great job, Paco, fighting injured. Very hard to do. Great job. Very proud. I then cornered this kid, Term. Um, he just didn't have a corner. He didn't have a coach. So I volunteered because it sucks going out there alone. You need someone to support you. You want someone to, to you know, literally be in your corner. Um, she don't feel so alone. That shit feels it's depressing being alone. Um, and he did a good job. He's Southpaw. He fought uh, Drew, I believe, Drew Montana. Again, another nice guy. Super nice guy. <clears throat> Southpaw versus Orthodox. Did a good job. Landed some hard punches. Won that fight. Decision. Harrington against Alex Stein. Um, hard fight. I was upset that Harrington couldn't find his range. It's hard when you fight someone who's so bad where the kid Alex Stein just kept smothering with bad punches, who's pushing his jab a lot. Like no pop, no, no snap to it, just like pressuring. He's bigger than Harrington, so he's pushing Harrington back a little bit. So that was annoying, but hey, good on him. 
it worked. Harrington got started getting a little sluggery and started, you know, brawling when he shouldn't be brawling. He should be boxing. But, um, yeah, good on him. He won. We lost by decision. I think Harrington really did more. He landed crisper punches. Alex was literally just pushing him backwards, which if you're a judge and you're in the moment, you can't recognize why someone's going backwards. You know, that's on you, whatever. And then Lewis <clears throat> versus Butterly. Really good fight, really good back and forth. They both did very well. Uh, Lewis had really good head movement. Was able to keep, him, keep Tim at the edge of his jab. Was able to land some good crisp uppercuts, some body shots. He had way more diversity of offense, which in boxing, is, in all fighting, but boxing is very useful because there's not that many targets, obviously. It's just the body or the head. But he did a great job. He did a good job listening. <clears throat> I, um, yeah, I'm happy. I'm psyched. They, 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 they put themselves out there to grow, and they did. You know, that's, that's the courage that it takes. Um, I think I did a pretty good job coaching. I saw some things I could work on and be better at, but all in all, a great trip. Very happy. Very proud of everyone. Thanks for watching. I'm tired. <laughs> Bye.